Hi. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Good, Good evening. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, let's wait, I think. Yeah. This is my second time, so I'm learning how to do it. I'm still learning. Missing anybody watching it? <laughs> Maybe you can tell me. <laughs> can we have more? <laughs> hi, can you say hi? Those who come in early, I, I can show to you that I have, I have a deal for you. Absolutely. Special deal here deals, today. Deals. Yeah, I think. Oh. Yeah. See, I have to learn how to sell. <laughs> yeah. Because we, I mean, if in case you haven't seen, you know, this is, yeah, this is a deal. Yeah, this is uh, from the Leicester Organic Farms in uh, Victoria. Yeah. It's uh, right in the beginning of the season, which is the, the nectarine, I'm sure. Yeah, let me offer you some. Absolutely beautiful yeah. nectarine. Thank you very much. I'll take a slice. So, a lot of, I mean, how, I mean, a lot of people may, may confuse what's nectarine or what's peach. And then normally, I think there will be four types. I think, yeah. Now nah, I have mine. You get, oh, you, you look, got all you one. Look, okay. Yeah, you get the whole one, yeah. Look at that. I mean, you hear yeah. that. It's delicious. It's sweet. Yeah. It's really, really good. I'm sure, you know, how to say, I mean, we can, of course, you, this is just a mock cup. But imagine you can use this your Christmas gift. Beautiful. Or maybe your. Absolutely beautiful. Your, your Thanksgiving gift. Yeah. Look at that. So you see, I'm slowly filling up the whole things. Yeah. Okay. So imagine you bring this. You bring this to your to your friend. You know what I mean. As a Christmas gift or a Thanksgiving gift. Yeah, I mean, this is really fresh and just right. It, it was still in uh, Melbourne. Uh, on the Wednesday night. Fabulous. And here, and, and here, it, here it is. Can't yeah. get fresher than that. So, how many people we have now? You see, do we have 13? Lucky for Can some. anybody say <laughs> hi? I'm going to offer views to you. <laughs> you must say hi at least, you know. <laughs> Otherwise, it can't be, can't be news. Yes, Very it, juicy. It really Very delicious. Very delicious. Let me, let me. What do you call it? Uh, the sound effect. Yeah, the ASIM, right? I mean, the ASMR. ASMR, yeah. Sorry, man. <laughs> yeah, pardon of my poor English. <laughs> oh, but I have to. My Mandarin's worse. We know that. <laughs> it's really good. Hi, Audrey. Absolutely so, delicious. Look at that. Let me tell you the view. That's the. This uh, hi, Puha. yeah, hi, Puha. yeah, good to see you. <laughs> it means good to see you again. Okay, the deal is oh, 22 people. Wow, well done. At least somebody is watching, but anyway, let me announce the deal. You have to like and share for, for me, like and share. And the deal is the Normally, the one kg of the nectarine we are selling at 26. Woo! Because, you know, the air fray and then it's okay. Yep. It's, it's, that's a tough part. It's very true. I always tell people about the air when they come I tell you that today because you are, you are here. You know, you are here with us. And really, I have to, I mean, we are really doing it for you. We thank you for your support. Yeah. yeah. Half price. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Half price for... 10 kg only. We only have we only have 10 kg here. Yes, I, I bring out already. So you see that's high. That's why I have confirmed that there's no blemishes. I mean that of course there's some blemishes. Sometimes there's it's not a lot, but definitely, you know, it's it, it's really good. It's quality. organic because yeah. the difference of the organic is really that they don't use any chemical fertilizers, they don't use any pesticides, they use a lot of compost, and they grow it without any, you know, because these things. Always a food fight. 
when the food price down, and then yes, that's all. Absolutely, we got to throw. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, yeah, so the organic farmers give me the price. I have to sell it, the price, but basically, don't even say that I don't make money. I probably this is to reward you seriously. So uh, if you want this, you can say in your comment. You say uh. This is white victory because I think the yellow is not so good yet. Now the white is good. And, and you know the difference is that the white usually is thin, is tougher, and the yellow, yellow is softer. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So so we we, we give, give you a deal. deal. I think this is it. Thirteen dollars for one kg. Wow. Yeah. Wow. I can't. Uh, oh, as a kg. Oh, can't. Okay, we <laughs> left the eight kg. I don't know who else wanted the eight kg. Thirty six. Yeah, I said you're not selling more. You have reason why others. Yeah, so I will quickly secure that. Yeah, later. Then I'll go to the warehouse and get it. Okay, like, but anyway, I mean this is yeah, it's really good. Yeah, so um, next week we'll do peach, but this week we'll do this. Yeah, because the peach is still small size. It's still not big enough. I yeah. Like and share, please. These are really good. Yeah, Mike and share with all my friends. Sweet, if it's going to be sweet. If it's not sweet, you bring back to me. I will take it back from you. And I'll eat them. Oh, I love drink. How do you? Thank you very much. Right. So, uh, today is just the first time we try this. Yeah, but you didn't give me this season, right? Yeah, yeah. I think first time we try it. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> but please, Audrey, we need you to like and share evening as well. Yeah. So those who want to buy, please have to like and share. Yeah. As many of your friends as you can manage. Oh. Uh. And then this time, we leave with side. I'll show you. He's watched some other videos and bring them over today. Don't push me. <laughs> it's just a flat rate of eight dollars, and you've got you've got yeah. the nectarines yeah. are quite sweet. It's so nice. I'm it's, it's delicious. Yeah. I'm very grateful. How many packs is one kg? I think one is about seventy to eighty grams. So it's about twelve. Twelve pieces. Yeah, size is good, and then taste is good. Yeah, it's not out of the street. I think this is. I think it's just flavorful. To me, it's delicious. I, I, I'm surprised how good it is. Yeah. So, okay. I think it's not enough. Ten seconds. Ten. Oh, I have to. Yeah. 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 Here we go. Well, we have to adjust the... Uh, Tony, can you have to adjust the, the screen in the back? I think... Yeah, do stop that. We lost it. Yeah, we lost it. Yeah, we try a lot of new things there. We we gotta put the screen behind us so you can see how we're doing. One oh. one one white egg drink is yeah. about ninety five grams. Just to let you know. Okay. Uh no, let me. So that's three. That's two hundred eighty grams. Yeah. Anyway, we're trying something new. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> I said you buy one morning for him. Later, I'll get free delivery deals for you. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so six is over 500 grams. So yeah. we're getting maybe about 11, 12 in a minute. Maybe in your way, and then we'll have deals again. Then those deals come with your free delivery, okay? That, that's right. If you, if you combine the deliveries, because there are some free deliveries coming up, then, then you'll be okay. Right. So you see, today we have to. Okay, I think deals are done. Okay. Finish. Esther, you want to buy? Audrey, you want to buy? Or whoever can say something just now, I'm, I'm, I'm open to sell to you, okay? <laughs> so I only have 10 kg. Yeah, so let me put it aside. Uh, I don't know, I just see it. It looks, it looks great. It looks okay, while well, I continue to eat, I think I want to answer a question that the customer asked the uh, broccoli. I mean, I just know. Mm, yeah. Yeah. The, Worms inside. So, <laughs> so uh, can we have the pictures of the broccoli? Yeah, uh, because recently there are, we we have 
the Australian shortage. Yes. Then we we speak to we speak to uh, Spanish, Spain. They, yeah. Yeah. The the vegetables come from Ana Lucia's mm. the broccoli. So but unfortunately, the there are a lot of FDs inside. Yeah. But it's fine that you know if you accidentally eat one again. Absolutely. Oh, it's very funny. I heard the first one from just now. Yeah. Well, right. I mean, yeah. 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 So, the colleague say, I mean, if, if, the, if the animal is feeding on the vegetables. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> That's my humor. If the ape is eating the broccoli and you eat the ape, where's the problem? Yeah. <laughs> It'll be fine. Because, I'm not saying that we eat a vegetarian, it's only fine. If you accidentally eat it, it's fine. In fact, we will have other deals for you that include the delivery. Include include free delivery. Yeah. 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 No worry. See how it's set up for you. Yeah. yeah. There may be something else you're interested in. Yeah. But so anyway, yeah. Do you have the active features or not? Uh, I suppose I. Uh, yeah. Can we show that. And uh, as lots of them says, we're, we're farmers. Uh, so we're yeah. kind of used to going out. And uh, uh, my, my. Yeah, yeah. this step picture, you show that picture. The one in the middle. That's awesome. Yeah, so, yeah, I just want to show you that, you know, we, we get colleagues to kind of like draw this illustration. Just open it up. Just open it up. Yeah. So, <laughs> at this is a sucking insect. Because Absolutely. broccoli is sweet. Mm -hmm. So they draw a lot of this uh uh this epics, but normally epics is vegetarian, so no problem, fine. right? Yeah, and then and then epics they normally eat like like uh uh long beans. Yes. Yeah. They yeah, love yeah. long beans. So what yeah. we'll do in the farm is actually we'll wash them. Yeah. They don't really like water and yeah. then they don't really like soap water, you know, right. soapy water. Yeah. So yeah, we'll get the street water to wash it now. And, and we used to have black aphids as well on our broad beans. Yeah. So I, I would earn sixpence, that's, those were the days, when I was going, I would go out and I would squish all yeah. the black aphids on the broad beans so that they didn't suck the juice yeah. from the broad beans. So you can see the child labor difference. Absolutely, child labor. Long, <laughs> long, long time ago. Anyway, I think, yeah, if you really cannot settle technically, Oh. Yay! Okay. So there you can see, so you see the baskets, right? So they walk on the, you know, they, they have the yep. stem, yep. and then they just suck. For all of you that do have them, you just take one of these big bowls, yeah. put salt yeah. water in, immerse yeah. the broccoli, and the aphids will just float up and you can just yeah. throw them out. Yeah. So it's no big deal, really. Yeah. So anyway, I think that's enough of this because we're supposed to rehearse for next week, right? Tomatoes, right? <laughs> <laughs> we're supposed to rehearse for next week. But, I mean, because just to tell you that next week we will be on Lazada Live and Maybe you think the boss is cheap scared that I don't want to get a KOL to do it. But I think I can do it. No, I don't no, know. no, you do it. You do it. It's fun when you do May it. May not be so good looking, but ah. yeah, it's good enough to do the presentations. Looks on everything. I mean, is head people dropping out? <laughs> 17. Sad. Yeah. Anyway, I'll try my best. I'll continue to do the work we're supposed to do. So today, actually, we will, we want to introduce you again the the tomatoes. Yeah. Because uh, 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 you may not hear clearly last week. What's our tomatoes? Okay. So I better put this down. And then have the tomatoes here. Yeah. So in case you don't know, uh, the tomatoes varieties where? where are, where's our chocotong? No, no, no. Oh, the small chocotong. Only the small one today. 
Yeah, no, no, a big one is here. Oh, okay. Sorry. So, let me introduce to you. Yeah, this is the big choco tom that I brought in the seeds from Korea. Yep. Then you know, and and you see the and we grow it in our farm in Cameron Island. Beautiful. Yeah. See the, so, this beautiful color. Yeah. yeah. So it, it goes through red, brown, green. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And if you look on the website, there's a new recipe up there using these choco toms with yep. a nice Asian sesame dressing. So very easy for yeah. you to try. So you just I mean, maybe yep. cut it and show yeah. yeah, and then you cut it and you taste it yourself. I mean, I carries is quite. I'm a, I'm a tomato fan. <laughs> no, that he doesn't tell any. He would tell my face, you know, if this is not nice <laughs> or this is wrong. Yeah. yeah, I'm a bit naughty. Yeah. So anyway, this is uh, tomatoes, and yeah, it's it's quite juicy as you can see that. Beautifully juicy. Yeah, the juice. Actually, coming out a little bit. Yeah. Ah, uh, maybe the light is too bright. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is good. Huh? Hmm. Now, this is time for your special tip. Yeah. Uh, oh. You see, maybe, maybe when you eat it like this, maybe it's a little bit. It's sweet, but you know, it's a big tomato. It's not so intense the flavor. Right. It's not like the the choco. Choco Tom on the vine, uh, which is growing a, a biodynamic farm in the southern uh, Holland. So this Choco Tom is it's more intense. Mm. But the tip is, you know, for whatever it is, you just put some salt on the. Yeah, let's see, show you. Yeah. Just you a little put, bit of the Himalayan yeah, rock salt. Yeah, you put salt. the salt, uh, and then and then you just. Uh, I think your taste will be much better. Much better. Mm. Correct, huh? Mm. Because it brings up a saltiness. Mm. Yeah. Mm. But let me let you try this. You see, I I'm confident enough <laughs> to eat like this, but better you. I, wash I always it. say, even organic, you wash first. Yeah, so yeah, that's yeah. me. That's okay. I just. My, my, my great aunt yeah, would I mean, say, why, why, why did you have farm to eat is a bit, I just, Yeah, exactly, that's what we used yeah, to do. Yeah, you yeah. have to eat a bit of dirt before you die. Why is this tomato good for? Quincy, this is very good to eat. I, I can tell mm. you that even, yeah, look at the face. Yeah, I can tell you that it's, the, the flavor is just so mm. intense. Mm. Why is tomato good for? I think, I think you can tell okay. Quincy about it. So basically, fresh tomatoes have a lot of vitamin C. Vitamin C, you know, is a fantastic antioxidant to boost the immune system. It's also very good to help you produce collagen so that your skin remains without wrinkles. Well, I, I'm getting on a bit, but it's not too bad, my skin. And of course, it has lycopene, the carotenoid ly lycopene, which is supposed to be very good to protect against prostate cancer. Yeah. So... I'll tell you a deal today. I don't have enough of the uh, the choco tom, the mm. big one, mm. but I have the small one. Okay. If you buy today, um, five hundred grams with discount, uh, how many percent? <laughs> it's twenty. It's supposed to be twenty eight per kg inside, and I will sell to you. Uh, so fourteen, fourteen per per. 500 grams. Wow. I'll sell wow. to you at 990. Wow, there's a deal again. I'd buy them. They taste yeah. delicious. Because we have the reserve to you. Because this one sells really fast. Yes. Yes. Yeah, this Choco Tom. Quite popular. You, I'm, so, I'm sorry to tell you that we are quite exclusive on these things. <laughs> you, in case you don't know, you can't find elsewhere. I, I've not seen it. Yeah, I've not no, seen it. No. no. And I do look around. So, um, Nine ninety. If you want to buy half a kilo, awesome. Yeah, awesome. Do we have people watching? <laughs> this guy, <is> so kiasu. <laughs> I don't see the numbers. Anyway, <laughs> if you want to buy, like and share, and then you can place the order by putting chocolate. Yeah, plus one or plus two. 
one one set is two i mean 500 grams yeah hmm. i like to do like you get to eat right yeah. <laughs> but normally i eat a lot of eat, so. <laughs> but you wouldn't tell you've still got a very good figure yeah so how are we going to introduce this uh dish today so this is i don't know if you can see i think perhaps you can yeah this is a traditional panzanella salad. So this is an Italian salad. Panzanella. Panzanella carne made from bread. Okay? okay. So it's a stale bread and tomato salad. It's what the peasants would eat uh, originally in Tuscany. And this was before the tomatoes were brought back from the New World. And it would have been stale bread, uh, onions, and whatever vegetables they had in their garden, tossed together with a little bit of uh, balsamic and olive oil. So this is all we've done here. I've salted the tomatoes. Tell me how easy you do it. Oh, you saw. It was that easy, right? Yeah. <laughs> so basically, what? Bread? Yes. I, I bought the bread yesterday, and I cut it up into small cubes so that it would air and dry. Mm. Then I took the tomatoes, cut them, Mm. salted the surface, collected the tomato juice because that's what's so delicious. Then I added a little bit of balsamic to the so juice. The tomatoes. Yes. Yeah. I, I, I actually sort of, well, I'm, I want to extract the juice from the tomatoes with the salt. So I've yeah. used the juice then yeah. to soften. Yeah. And then all we're going to do now yeah. is add our wonderful, wonderful olive yeah. oil. And then I'm going to serve you a bit and you can make comments. <laughs> we have a juice for olive oil, right? Can we put up a juice? Yeah, like I say the olive oil, you want to taste the quality, let me, <laughs> let me, oh, where's the spoon? Okay, the spoon is here. Yeah. Yeah, to, to taste the quality again, yeah, probably Evelyn and the rest are really watching, but. <laughs> it's still got olive oil. with me, okay? I have, to, <laughs> I have to test, drink it to show you how good it is. It's like sampling wine. You take in yeah, air as you take in the oil. Uh, can you see, can you see? Yeah, you see, you see the golden color, golden and green, and then you, when you drink it, mm, good. The peppery flavors. Yep, and it hits the back of the yeah. throat. It shows how fresh is this, and not processed. Absolutely. Because it's the first cold press. Absolutely. By the, the group of farmers in Cheva in yep. the fifty kilometers north of Valencia that we work with. Beautiful. I say Juan. The person who just passed away yeah. was really a good guy. So, yeah. I mean, uh, yeah, we have his photo on the wall. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 We'll, we'll show the photos. Yeah. I mean, yeah. if you are interested, yeah, but yeah. Yeah. lovely family. We salute to yeah. the one. So, so there it is. Very I think simple. the tips is really to add to dry the bread because to, you to don't want it to be too Not soggy. Because I've said to use a hard, yeah, the, use a harder bread, right? This this is a sourdough uh, country loaf. So this is a very good mm. bread. How is that? Oh. Mm. Is that an oh, oh, good? You it? Is it good? You it? Yeah. I haven't tasted it, so. <laughs> yeah. The olive oil, what quantity? I don't cook by quantities. You no. saw what I did. I just drizzled it. <laughs> Six dollars for one pound deep. Oh. 250 ml. <laughs> Normally, we say uh, A90. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. I saw it's 250 ml. I say, you know, if I'm here, I really bring you deals. Yes. So this is this is for drizzling. Yeah. Not for but, bathing in. You know, please, Esther, share this live with your as, friends. As many then, as you possible. Know, yeah. Because yeah. yeah, the whole idea is, is you know, we give deals here. We really want people to try our products and and taste it and, and feel about it. Yeah. Right. So you see, I, I, my, my what, my script is not followed yet. You know. <laughs> Yeah, he, he wants to give you deals more than anything. Yeah. Anyway, I think I'll be quite dumb last, next week when I'm in Lazada Live. <laughs> no, you'll be fine. Um, so well, I'm glad he's going back for another spoonful. That that that's that bodes well. <laughs> it's nice, I can tell you. It's, okay, good. It's one of the things in during a Christmas you can easily <laughs> I would see. Yes, it's good. You hear the <laughs> Let me probably do it again. <laughs> mm. But you have to be sure that your tomato tastes good. Yes. 
And these are our heirloom tomatoes, so this they're is very one special. Best, uh, yeah. Festive, festive, uh, yeah, appetizer. Especially for this kind of climate. Yeah, yeah. Because this thing, these things will go with the uh, wine or beer or anything. Fantastic. Yeah, because yeah, yeah you'll drink. Yep. <laughs> yep. My my beer replacements is the <laughs> is the kombucha. Yeah. Yeah. So also fermented. Yeah, also fermented, <laughs> and uh, yeah, hopefully the sugar is almost gone, but there's still some leftover sugar. Residual so sugar. Yeah. yeah. Very good. So it's good. And let me see. I taste the tomatoes. You see, I have to follow the script today. <laughs> really, that we are doing homework. We're, we're pr practicing for Lazada and they're very strict. So we have to do as we're told. Tips, and then we taste the tomatoes and then I will give you the deal. So the deal for the, for the tomatoes uh, box. Yep. Special You buy these yep. five uh, Five only. We give the deals, free deliveries. Uh, six types of tomatoes. Okay. Yeah, definitely worth it. In a box, normally we sell at twenty six, right? Normally. Yeah. Twenty six. Twenty six plus Today delivery. Today we sell to you, but delivery is eight dollars. Eight dollars is thirty four. Yeah, my math is too good. I'm, he, I'm not. His math is excellent. I sell to you at twenty, including deliveries. Yep. So that's a great save. Yeah. This you won't go wrong because you get these uh heirloom tomatoes. Heirloom tomatoes with four types of tomato inside. We got a chocolate tom, we got a uh plum cherry tomato, which is really sweet also. You get a golden nuggets. Yep. And then you have the the other one is a yellow very pale, sweet, right? Yeah, yellow yep. sweet tomatoes, yep. which is great for this dish. This salad makes yeah. it very pretty. It really and then is you get the tomato on the vine. Cherry yeah, tomatoes. You get, you get yep. Just when you cook pizza or when you cook pasta. No, 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 no. Eat them raw. <laughs> They're so good. And then you get the uh, tomato on the vine. Yeah. Which, which you which can have with the um, yeah. gorata salad yeah. that we did last week. And you get the uh, chocotone big size. Yep. Which the recipe yeah. is on the re website. Basically, for. the small, and then you get the golden tomatoes that we grow From in Malaysia. Malaysia's, uh, yep. Our Kampung Raja farmers, which is really good. Also things. sweet, right? So you see. These these things and all these things, these small tomatoes is basically fruits. And the chocolate, right? What's it what is it good again? The flavor nine. Then, um uh, oh the lycopene. Lycopene. Yeah, yeah. lycopene is a, a very, very good carotenoid which yeah. protects against things like prostate cancer. Yeah. So I have to show you again. Okay, one, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six. Six. The one we opened. Okay. Yeah. Deliver to your home at twenty. It's a deal. It's a steal. Deliver to your home. No? Yeah, free, free delivery. Yeah. yeah. So, I, yeah, I mean, just to show you how good it is, and I'm very confident. <laughs> if you are not happy, you can just write on our Facebook. I think I'll deal with you. <laughs> yeah. Privately. <laughs> mm. So good, right? So good. If you never realize that how well, one of the key key points on these tomatoes is I would say ninety five percent of the tomatoes you buy in the market are all grown in the cocoa pit. Yes. With the chemical fertilizer yes. dripping. Yes. And they're not on soil. What's the problem is when they are not on soil, their nutrients is quite mono. Yes. Even though they can be sweet, but they are not flavorful. No, and yeah. it's not balanced either, no. because when you look after the soil, the soil has a whole series of macronutrients and micronutrients. So you may be putting the macronutrients into the solution, but what about the rest of the organisms that actually make up the biodiversity yeah. Yeah. of the ecosystem? You're losing out. The plants are losing <coughs> out, and they're not producing so such good, good fruit. <laughs> so, okay. Last 10 seconds. If you want to buy, you get it. Otherwise, we'll move to the next one. But I can tell you, this is a very good dish for your Christmas gathering. Yep. You can invite five to your home. Hopefully, government will say six yep. or seven. Thank you very much, Esther. Yeah. Free delivery. See, Thank you, Audrey. I, I say I'm not. Awesome. I'm for you. <laughs> Free delivery. <Yeah. laughs>
Okay. Very good. I think that Esther and Audrey will, will send them some of this also. <laughs> yeah. Shallot. A few of it. Yeah. yeah. Both of you will share this box of shallot. Yeah. I'll show you this thing. This shallot is this shape. This is from Brittany. This shallot. Yeah. It's sweeter than the normal. And that was actually oh, in Oh, you there. put it in? Yes. Oh. Tiny, 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 tiny pieces I think you remember to send them the recipes. Yes. Can. Yeah. Can. Oh. So if, we'll print out the recipes for them. If you can see, them. there are little tiny pieces of shallot actually on the tomato. Yeah. I can tell the sweetness is really there, and then, and this this dish is to to go for. One one of the recipes you can check our website. Yeah. Sweet potatoes, yeah. Do we have the farm pictures? Yeah. This is the sweet potatoes uh, uh, that we have. Okay. Again, you know, I have to explain that, you know, the sweet potatoes, what so, what so is grown in uh, Ipoh uh, by our farmers, uh, that we seed funded them and then we'll show them the pictures. Where's the pictures of the sweet potatoes? As always, why why do you show this phone pictures? Maybe we can turn off the pictures already. Yeah, the cameras, yeah. Yeah. So you see how we grow the sweet potato here, you see, is you know we, we make a tri triangle on the you know how do you, how do you call that the, the little mountain that Oh yeah. Oh, you make oh shoes. like a furrow. Yeah, yes. furrow. Yeah. yeah. So it's like this, and then we we put the plant in this way, forty five degrees. Oh, okay. Get into the soil. So so that because we bring it up so that there are not so many how to say blockage to block the sweet potatoes. Because when we grow the sweet potato in the heartland. Yes. Actually, cannot, it doesn't right? grow. It, no. it will stuck there. Yeah. So we grow into this way. And it's a sandy loam, right? Sandy that's loam. Why yeah, that's why yes. it grows. Yeah. So because this sand. This place can only grow sweet potato because if you grow other vegetables, it's too hot. Huh. And then the the how do you say? I mean the the roots doesn't really claw. So yeah. it, it can't yeah. get a good feed. But the yeah. thing is, if you if you um, grow it normally, you know, like our neighbors farmers, yep. they grow it conventionally. They actually yep. put pesticides yep. first. Yep. Because what you get is the weevil. Oh, okay. Do we have a weaver pictures? Yeah. Let, let, let's see the beast that yeah, gets the, the sweet potatoes. Because uh, the weavers actually pass through the pass through the sweet potatoes. Yeah. They, they they have the kind of elephant trunk that they, they go bore, through. They, the through. Yeah. 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 So there we go. There's the weavers. The other one. Can we <laughs> zoom in? Zoom in. Yeah. Yeah. Zoom in to the weavers. Zoom. Yeah. So that's why you know the sweet potato. You say it's very easy to grow, you know, you may hear from Grandma or in the Second World War, we are eating sweet potato every day. Well, that's a good thing as far yeah. as I'm concerned. So, I think Carrie has a tip for your pets. I, I, I do. Yeah. Um, actually, not just for your pets. The sweet potato is very high in carotenoids. That's a great picture. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, you can see his nose as well. You can yeah. see how he bores in. Anyway, they're full of the beta carotenes, the antioxidants, plus a wonderful amount of fiber. Yep. So this is good for anybody who has any constipation, anybody who wants to prevent macular degeneration, and you can use it when your dog has constipation. Now, my mother always fed the dogs okay, vegetables the, as well as the meat, okay? <laughs> enough of the worms pictures. <laughs> yeah, you hear that? If your dogs get constipation, I don't know how do you feel that. How do you see whether your dogs get um, I think they have difficulty when they're actually passing motion. Did I tell you? No, you can see. You can see. I used to I take the dogs dog. for a walk. Yeah, I don't have a dog. <laughs> yeah. We How do. We, we do have yes, apple we sweet have. potatoes. I think it's on our, on our yep. website, www.dancing.com.sg. And our website is just revamped. Yeah. I think, can we try, Matthew, can we try to search whether purple sweet potato appear in our website? You can try our website and then you can see the we search bar. We definitely have them. And then you can 
we can try that. It's, it's not on a deal today, but the sweet potato, we have a deal today. Yeah, we have a deal today, which is uh, in Singapore, we are selling it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, sweet potato deals. Okay, yeah, this is purple sweet potatoes. Yeah. Yeah, you can try that. It's good. The purple sweet potato is yeah. really good. You. It's delicious. Yeah, we. I normally cook uh, porridge for my yeah. kids. Yeah, and I, I took them out and I did a purple sweet potato puree. It's much denser than the orange one. Yeah, yeah. So I had to lighten it up a bit and I put coconut oil in. Because remember, the beta carotene is the pro-vitamin A. Vitamin A, of course, is fat-soluble. So this is fat-soluble, and you need a little bit of fat. In this one, I put butter. I, in this one, oh, I put coconut oil. You yeah, can you, put olive oil as well. You see that? You see that? Oh. And that makes the beta-carotene beta more bioavailable. So, can we put some butter in? So, yes. instead of the, again, holiday, uh, you know, your kids, instead of the, what do you call that, the mesh, yeah. Potatoes. yeah. You, you can have much sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes. Yeah. And you see it's the color, the golden color. Beautiful. Yeah, and then yeah. Yeah, and then you and I was thinking this would be gorgeous oh. on a plate with a bed of the sweet potato and a nice juicy steak yeah. on top of that. What's so special <laughs> is you know the, normally tomato uh, potato mashed potato is it's quite bland. Because yes. Although the potato has some flavor but not strong, but sweet yeah. potato is as extra layers of this yeah. taste. Gorgeous. 2 kg for $20 and then I deliver to you. Free. Yeah, free. <laughs> and Malaysia's is $40, 40 ringgit, so I will deliver to you. Yeah. <clears throat> so you can put down, you know, you want to buy, yeah. Or if you decided 1 kg of the cream. Thank you. Hmm. Can I? It's good. Okay. I think we should, we can replace it as well. I mean, we can, we can share during next week's live. Okay. I mean, next week we won't be here, we'll be in Lazada. Oh, you mean rather than the price? We'll share two in case. Wow, okay. <laughs> so, sweet potato, I mean, you know that, you know, that's why, why eating organic. Yeah. You know that you don't have these nasty things that with you. You don't and, have pesticides, you don't have fungicides, yeah. you don't have herbicides, yeah. you don't have chemical fertilizers yeah. with only macronutrients. Yeah. So, um, let me see how many people we have now. 24. Okay, increase. <laughs> thank you for staying back. <laughs> I thought you would drop out, but thank you. I think I have a This one, someone can eat later. No problem. Okay. Our third dish. You see, we, we are so holy there, actually, you know? Yep. Because these things, any of this you do, you impress your guests. Absolutely, and it's yeah. really simple cooking. Yeah, really, really just... You don't need any cordon yeah. bleu certificate. How does it taste? <laughs> It'll taste right. I mean, okay. uh, it's my so-called, you know, they're making a cost law. Yep. My tips, if you think it's not nice... You can rebalance, no problem. Yeah, with what? Honey. With a, with a, with yogurt. a yogurt and honey. Yeah, absolutely. That, no matter how, it. how you know, how you don't know how to cook, I think you can save this cost law anytime. Yes. Can sweet potato eaten raw? No, I wouldn't recommend so much. I think the starch, you have to digest it. So We, we have made raw sweet potato chips in the dehydrator, but I did not like them. No. no okay. I, I prefer them steamed. Because steam. starch yeah. is just like rice. Yeah. Yeah. You don't really eat rice raw no, because you have no. to somehow you have to cook the starch or yep. you have to yeah yeah make the starch cook yes yeah so yep. it depends on how you how you do it yeah suppose we have to say oh yeah we have to say we have you see I have to refer back we have said the goodness of sweet potato right yes we did <laughs> and we told them it was good for dogs constipation yeah you, you, <laughs> I, you know I'm not really a <laughs> Uh, you know, news, good news presenter, but I think <laughs> talking trash, I'm okay. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, I think we, why not, I'm not supposed to eat this first. I think according to the script. Oh, okay. I have to introduce cabbage. Okay. Where's cabbage? Cabbage is right there. Yeah. Cabbage is here. You see cabbage. So, what's the difference of our cabbage and the cabbage you buy 
in the wet market or you know the conventional cabbage is normally you get the Beijing cabbage that's grow in uh China or it's grow in a uh, uh in a uh, uh Indonesia. Okay. Malaysia you have some but not a lot. Yep. Yeah. Normally the Malaysia ones they sell higher price even for conventional. Okay. Parts of Indonesia are very high, yeah. so they have a cooler climate, yeah, yeah. and the cabbage is not bad. But then you okay. know that when they when they grow the the um, Beijing cabbage, they 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 are round shaped, they are like yes. ball. Yes, yes. You no, know, you see ours is flat. Flat, yeah. Yeah. So this is a different species. Different variety. Yeah. yeah this is yeah. this is the the. There they are. Look. Yeah. So this is the the flat cabbage is a is a Japanese variety seed. Ah. Yeah, which is when you bite it is easier easier to bite. It's crunchy. And then it's crunchier. Yeah. And then when you stir fry it, it's crunchier. Okay. And it's, it's actually softer as well. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. it's very nice yeah. when you stir fry it. So, um, yeah, you see where the cabbage is growing. You know, we, we say this is a place I love to go. And then uh, I make Zensin travel. This is the destination that I will bring you to. It's where the ridge of the hill. You see, this is the top of the hill already. That you are actually inside the cloud. Yeah. We'll call it the cloud forest. Yeah. If you don't know what is cloud forest, you can go to Gardens by the Bay and then you can read about it. Yeah. Because the whole Garden by the Bay, you have, they have two sections. Yep. Flower Dome and then the cloud forest. Yep. That's the meaning of the cloud forest. And they have a very interesting variety of plants up yep. there. Yep. So, but this cloud forest, because they, they are wet, in, in the tropics, the, uh, they are wet, that's why they have a lot of cloud. Yeah. Yeah, because the condensed, I mean, the they, they get a lot yeah. of water. And because and then, it's higher, it's cooler yeah, 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 as well, yeah. right? So yeah. the cabbage love that. Ah. The cabbage love that. Yeah, and then yeah. they grow beautifully in uh, Rinchang, you know, in the the highest plateau yeah. of the yeah, yeah. Cameron Island, which is really, I mean, yeah, is this is this a video? Yeah, this is a video. Yeah, you see the cabbage is moving. Yeah. Yeah, you see the cloud, you see the cabbage is moving. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. really enchanting. I know you love to go there now, but... Yeah. Too bad. I think bad. next time you can join me. Yeah, and then can we show again the the, the video of the cabbage harvesting? We'll do these exact actions in uh, in our tour. Okay. For Zensu travel, okay. we really will cut the we harvest the cabbage. I, I think for me, the foundation of Zensin actually yeah. was from cabbage from the Cameron Highlands. Yeah, if yeah, I yeah, 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 yeah. My, yeah? Well, Organic I mean, cabbage. Yeah. Myself and my dad. You yeah. Know, we, we brought down the whole whole car load. Yeah. Of the cabbages, yeah, yeah. you know, because so this thing is the cabbage. first thing that we tasted. Yeah, yeah. It's so different. Yeah. So you, you see, it's growing so high. And you see all the holes at the leaf at the side of the cabbages. You know, it's, it's really that, you know, you see a lot of the snails. And then we yeah. might fly as well. But, right? you know, we don't yeah. mind to share no. our food with the no. insects. No. So, no. yeah, we, we just we want the hearts. They can have the leaf. And that's how you can tell it's organic yeah. again. If you see the holes, yeah. Yeah. you know. You see the yeah. holes somewhere also. You see the holes survive, here also. Yeah? Yeah. You know, you see the holes here also. Yeah. yeah. So these things is you can easily stir fry it. You can uh you know Eat it make cost law yeah. uh, which what Kerry has done. I think Kerry can show. Yeah. So if we can have the camera over here, can we? Can you see? Yeah. So this is a very very simple coleslaw. It's one whole cabbage, one whole carrot, one stick of celery. And one yeah. red apple. That's it. Yeah, I'm sure you'll impress your guests because these things is, I'll say, because normally you use the cabbage, I think, sorry to say, it's not nice. <laughs> if you use the conventional one. I wouldn't eat it. <laughs> yeah, it's because, you know, a lot of times, uh, uh, just like the leafy vegetables, yeah, the kids love to eat our vegetables because... They taste better. Yes. Sorry, they taste better. Yes, because we don't, they, you don't... Thank you, Evelyn. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Evelyn. Yeah, it's, it's really the, the taste of the vegetables make them irritate yeah. The, yeah. the vegetables. I yeah. think this is, yeah. this is very clear. So, yeah. I mean, uh, what, we, what we are here doing a job of the vegetables curator, you know, we yes. actually curate the vegetables yeah. for you and then we really choose the best for you. That's, yeah, that's I think this is, this is very clear. Absolutely true. So this cabbage, you can just stir fry, you can make coleslaw. Yep. And with the carrots, I think it's yep. good. Yeah, this is yeah. an Australian carrot this time. Yeah. And for this dressing, I've taken uh, mm. something like a Greek yogurt with live cultures in it. Oh. And I've taken the raw fresh honey from Indochina. 
I've taken a little bit of, is this German, the cider vinegar? Mm. And juice of the lemon. Okay. And I want to introduce this salad seasoning. Now, I'm really excited about this whole range of spices. And this you can use because I, I don't have mustard here in the shop, right? Yep. But this has white and black mustard seeds in it. Mm. And if you make the dressing and add the seasoning and let it stand, yep. it adds that little flavor of mustard into everything. Yep. So this is a wonderful salad dressing. You need to let it stand for about 15 minutes so that it actually takes yep. on the flavors. And then you just add it to the coleslaw. Now, I must say is, I would I would prefer to have more honey. I know Singaporeans would. Yep. I, 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 I'm not pro sugar, as you know. And he, <laughs> she added a special ingredients inside, which I thought you wouldn't add. What's that? Celery. Celery, yes. Celery is good for you. I know, but yeah. you may spoil some kids' uh, fun. I, I mean, if your kids don't really like it, I no, will. No, Chloe doesn't like it. I, I tested it on her yesterday, yeah. and she said, I said, how is it? And she said, it's good, but I don't like the celery. However, celery seeds are traditional in coleslaw. Okay. Let's do, I'll put apples. You could, apples in there. There's an apple. apple, apple. You, can, you can just remove the celery. You don't have to put That's why I tell Carrie's, you know, don't complicate <laughs> the dish. It's, you can make it as easy and still tastes good. Is you look put a lot of cabbages. Yeah. You put probably about ten percent of the carrots because you can already or you already get the it's, it's orange about, colors. It's about half half. Um, yeah. So it's about four hundred grams of cabbage, two hundred grams of carrots. I only put more cabbages. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. If you want some crunchy taste, yep. you can put some add some uh, purple cabbages. Purple cabbage yeah. would be lovely. Yes. Yeah. So yep. you get a crunchy, uh, yep. extra crunchiness. Yeah. And then you put in, yeah the. The yogurt that you want, and then yep. you season with again. I say when you make these dishes, you have to remember to put enough salt because a lot of times, I mean, salt too much is not good for you. Salt yeah. in there, so yeah. I, I didn't add extra. There's salt in that one. Salt is not good, not but moderately you have yep. you can yep. take in moderate salts. So I would say that you know the thing is, it's just like you stir fry vegetables. Yeah, you have to put salt. Yes. In some form or other. Same. It can be soy sauce, can be fermented black same bean sauce, as but the, it's the same idea. As a coleslaw yeah. that you have to put. And the salt makes the cabbage sweeter. Yep, yep. Yeah. And you actually yep. bring out some extra juice from your cabbages. Yep. So the cabbages taste crunchier. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So you add in the yogurts and then you add in the, you know. More honey. More honey. <laughs> yeah, you can. Uh, if you don't have lemon, you can just add in a little bit of the uh Apple what? cider vinegar to so massage it first. Yeah, this has both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I say we we'll, we'll yep. make an easy versions. Okay. So when you have the vinegar, the the idea is actually to massage the vegetables. Yep. Make it softer as well. Yep. Yeah. Then, you know, you taste it with the honey and the yogurt that you like. Yep. And boom, another nice dish. Very nice get. dish and very simple. Yeah. All these things are really simple. Yep. Yep. How? Yes. Purple cabbage we would put in, but there wasn't any, right? No, not really. <laughs> or is it just coming again? <laughs> we have them coming again. Okay. Uh, yeah. This is from uh, um, Australia. Okay, just came in. Yeah. Awesome. You hear the crunchiness, right? Yeah, it's good. So, this just arrived today. Yeah, you can check out our website. Sorry, there's no deal, <laughs> no deal for this. this. This one's very expensive. But what's our cabbage deal? Okay, really good deal. Two pieces of cabbage for five dollars. Excellent. I can't deliver to you at five dollars. Sorry, but <laughs> if you want, just you want cabbage. You just Absolutely. tell us. Yeah. You want cabbage? Cabbage plus one or plus two? Two pieces for five dollars. And and this is my take. Yeah. But I think everybody should eat cabbage at least once yeah. a week. <laughs> yeah. Why? Well, yeah, but maybe Chinese not so much. But some really like cabbage, you know. I think, uh, especially, you know, you stir fry with a little rice stream. Yes. Oh, did I Yeah, yeah. You know, awesome. Even yep. the Japanese, what, sakura shrimps. Oh, the, yeah, the, yes, all the little tiny uh, dishes as well. And I learned something, is, which is a Sichuan way of cooking it with the vinegar and the chili, the dry chili. That would be good. Yeah. And Sichuan pepper? Uh, 
a little bit. Yeah, this is one of the one of the dishes. Canola, too expensive for. Ah. Oh. Air, airplane ticket. <laughs> No, 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 Evelyn want to buy it all. <laughs> no, my oh. Evelyn, you can tell. I think our our customer service can tell you. Tell you. Yes, the customer service will definitely yeah, help. Yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this. Little, Thanks for support, Evelyn. Yeah. This, this little one here is uh, about seven hundred grams, and it's yeah. nine nine nine. Yeah. Just to give Please you an idea. Please help to share. Okay. Please help. Uh, do we have <laughs> how many people we have now in the on the screen? Still 24, okay. But at least you are here, you are there to, to listen to me. <laughs> Appreciate that really. Yeah, and the honey, the honey we have deals, right? I, I I think I mentioned about honey deals. H honey deals. Yes, you did. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah, the usual price is 1990. And then Okay, we sell to it twenty five percent discount at fifteen dollars for one nine hundred grams of one kg of honey. Awesome. Yeah, raw this raw honey, honey. This is this yeah. is totally Very good. unheated honey. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is really good. And then it's forty five ringgit. Yeah. Yeah. If yep. you are in Malaysia. Yeah. Only in this life, and then you tell us you want honey. I want honey. And then please remember to share. Yes. Yeah. Share with as many people yeah. as you can. So, good. One, two, three. Okay, I did an overrun because I spent the first ten minutes to talk about the factory. <laughs> you see, I'm I'm still on my script. Yeah, I make sure I'm doing it right. And then we have the goji berry deals also today. I mean, oh yes, because you can add in goji berry in your yeah. We deliver Dorothy. We deliver. Where do you live, Dorothy? You can share with us. Yeah. Yeah, the goji berries. What's the goji berry deals? I think we have the goji berry deals. Two for nine dollars, and then two for twenty-seven ringgit. Yeah, it's also a very good deal because this goji berries. Yeah, I have to. Good for your eyes, right? You see, I have to buy this goji berry. <laughs> yeah, I cannot just eat it free, right? You, you gonna try it with the coleslaw? Try it with the coleslaw. You you okay. don't need to soak it or whatever. Carry one to soak it. But I say we have enough of the soaking. I mean, thank you. Like when your mom cooked the goji berry to yeah. you, in the Chinese way, it's always in the soup. Yeah. Yeah. But this goji berry would bring in from a single farm. Really? Only one farm in Inner Mongolia. Inner Mongolia. And I know the Sweet. boss. They grow them themselves. Ah, yeah. So is they grow them with as as little uh can be, I mean uh uh. What do you call that? Uh, organic uh, biocontrol or uh, organic pesticides. Yeah. They don't use any. So, yeah. it's free from nicotine residues. Wow. I can tell you that most of them they in use the market, nicotine. even if it's organic. Yeah, they, they use nicotine they, to kill the pest. Yeah, they, they use something called matrin yeah. to kill the pest, which yeah. is allowed in the organic uh, yeah, farming, farming. Yeah. but they don't use it. But this farm doesn't use it. That's no. awesome. And that's USDA. Organic, yeah, right? And the U. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, I saw them in uh, Germany and then I'm. Oh, I love good. them and then. So I will put it in my salad. Yes. And yeah. this is a way to Asianize your coleslaw, of course. I can tell you this. You see this? See this goji? And I'll just pop it into my mouth. <laughs> you know what's good now? It's good for your eyes. Yes. Very good for your eyes. Extremely good for your eyes. Yeah. It's That's actually she... related to the tomato. It's Solanaceae. It's the same family. Yeah. You will. Uh, we don't, as you saw. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite clean. Is it sun dried? It's sun dried, yeah, but it's sun quite clean. Yeah. So the sun itself has helped Sarah, to I... ultraviolet everything with its rays. So sun dried goji berries from Inner Mongolia. You are advised to wash a little bit, but. I'm okay with that. Like I, my, my farming aunt always used to say, you I have to tell you that before you die. <laughs> I can tell you that this is this is something really good for kids. Yeah. This is something that you can even eat, add to your coleslaw. Add to your coleslaw. Yep. And you eat it. It's, it's never. It, it will it will have a dish. Yep. Okay. Now I left 15 minutes. Sorry, you have to OT a little bit. 
Blueberries and uh, bananas, no. is it? Xinhui. <laughs> oh, we'll come Xinhui again. Nice. Hmm. Remember the deal is two for nine dollars for goji berry. Evelyn and who else? Evelyn and uh, Esther, you want to add? It's better than to buy from a shop, really. <laughs> this is to reward you for watching me. You see, I'm so... How did I say? I'm fine. Yeah, Xinhui, are you ready? Yeah, I'm all right. Hello. Yeah. Okay, Hi. Where do? Let Xinhui do. Yeah, show Can't you how believe to, I'm how to cook. Here on Dancing Live for the second time. You can <laughs> ask my boss why he invited me. <laughs> There's a special reason behind it because uh, not it's, it's not because uh, I like cook. The thing is, you know, about <laughs> Xinhui is, you know, this is how. This is like the lunch cooker for her. Yes. It's, there's it's a no, wonderful tool. So she can blend what? Eggs, anything. Eggs and anything. avocado potato. inside and sweet potato. Eggs and sweet potato inside <laughs> to make a dish. So. Yeah, extra anyway, protein, ex sweet potato puree. Yeah. So this is how she will do. So it's very, very, very. I mean, if she can cook, everybody can do. Yeah. If, if we can cook, everybody can cook. Yeah. Yeah, but I used to have the nickname Quiz Kitchens. Quiz yeah. Kitchen. Nobody can visit us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because it's never open. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> it's never open. <laughs> yeah. So today I'm going to show you very simple dishes that, uh, mm. whenever I you don't feel like eating my usual fruits, I just want to do it differently. So I blend them together. So you know our Singapore teacher weather is very hot sometimes you just like something cold and chill yeah yeah so what you need is um look at this overripe banana yeah i think the most important thing is this overripe banana you, you don't want to throw, throw away yeah, don't throw away. yeah you so have you a do? lot of things to make you of this what i need to do usually i freeze them but today yeah. i just freeze my blueberry so that yeah. i can show you the blending process <laughs> yeah so, so the tips is actually Overripe banana. Yeah, overripe banana, when you freeze it, yeah, it, it already become a ice, ice cream. cream texture. Yeah. Yeah. When you know, I have friends uh, who actually eat it with the peanut butter. Yep. Or you know, even honey, because when once it's frozen, and then different frozen banana actually you get different tastes. Yes. As well. Yes. Yeah. Today I, mean, I chose the Thai one. In case one. you don't know how many types of banana we have. We have the 40 days banana, the fingers banana from Malaysia, which is very thin skin. And I think, Shima, you are taking the monkey banana, right? Correct. This is a, because the this is the only overripe banana, banana we is, have. This is uh, like the... Uh, you need to? Uh, you call it the gilin. Yeah, the, the gilin jo. Yeah, this is the, what you call it, the... The... Uh, pisang brangan. Uh, yeah. So this is uh, actually, yeah, this taste is good as well. But I, I my personal favorite is the, the Namwa banana, the, 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 the sweet Thai banana. sweet banana, yeah. which, you know, actually every, every kids in Thailand, they, they grow up with that yeah. sweet banana because it is so, it's creamy. It's like the, it's like what? It's like the chewing gum, only bit of chewing gum. You know, you, you get the chewing gum. Taste, but then uh, not the taste, the kind of a chewiness. All right. And then uh, the, texture. the textures, and yeah. still it's still good. I think it's, and you the sweetness is is different. I must say, you know, you it's chewy and then it it stuck in your on your teeth, and it's it's good. It's nice. Second forces you take it off, right? Yeah, well, it's <laughs> it's really. I mean, uh, that one. Yeah, it's have been very popular. Okay. Yeah. What the do you second have now? ingredient is avocado. Do you know how to pick the firm uh ready to eat avocado? It's very simple. You just need to press it on the tip on the tips. Tip. Then you can have a gentle pressure, then you feel it's just about right to eat. Yeah, to me yeah. it's really it's just tip. Yeah, the, the tip of the avocado when it's soft. Yeah. Uh and there then you go. it's ready to eat. Yeah. Just cut it, very nice avocado. Yeah. We have been having the avocado from uh, uh, from California and Mexico. Yeah, so, yeah. but I will still rank the avocado. If you want me to rank the quality of avocado.
这边发现的缺点，所以造成智能管理的问题。啊，现在这里呢，现在这里有好，以前我们那发现好像也有问题，比较少，所以啊，啊，所以。Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Even to your home, and you can get something else. Yeah, you can see our view. Yeah, I think you we only open open it until another ten minutes for you. We have a close shop here. Hey, Harry. Hi, Harry. Nice to see you. See you. Thank you, Dorothy. Thanks. Yeah, how do I think? Yeah, I mean, ah, really good to see you. Friends and yeah. how tired of how we how we talk. Yeah. We try to experiment something, but okay, sorry, yeah. we're still working. We're still working. Working progress. The nuts in the water is a pre soap before. Sorry, we didn't pre soap before the hydration yeah. because I mean it's not activated. No. Uh, I'm not because you have to do it. Uh, some because is what we our experience is we pre soap to keep hydrate. If you don't do it properly, it's difficult. It's very difficult. You get molded. Angie doesn't. Yeah, yeah. But she has a good plate, so that. But it's it's not easy. It's not easy. Just there's still somehow they mold it. That's why fine. Just we also put it. Yeah. Just we also put it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean the 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 dry foods. Yes. So it takes the water from the foods. Yeah. Or you you better I mean you can you dehydrate it, meaning that at least we don't spoil the fat. It doesn't go over sixty degrees. Yeah, sixty-five. Over sixty-five. Yeah, at least, at least the oil comes out. No, you still taste the oil. Yeah, it's not like a different flavor. Just and crunchy. Yeah, yeah, and raw. That that's the whole point. Yeah. So, so I don't activate it. I know there's a lot. Let's say you activate it, you activate it, but it is good. I know. It takes a lot of attention to do. And it's a lot of time to actually. This activation business, I haven't seen a really good brand actually. So I stick to this dehydrate, dehydrate tanks, and then we don't do a single dehydrate. It's the same dehydrate we use. Still use it. I think I activate. So Christmas, you can still order this from us, and New Year, you are expected to see new deals, and then I think if you haven't seen our new line, we have the, we have the. Right, because all the Turkish ones, yeah. Hold on. And we have the new dates coming in as well. Excellent. Yeah, I mean, you can literally pack the, you know, if you want, if you want us to send our own patients to keep your friends. We have a handful. Yeah, we can do the handfuls for you. Oh, so we can we have a handful that you can pack in, and you know you can have the. We have our special boxes. Special box, yeah, yeah, with the nectarines or yep. all the tomatoes. If you want, absolutely. You just specify to us you want the wooden box. I think you can. We can easily do it for you. And then, um, and yeah, I mean, in case you haven't seen at the sea bottom juice, uh, which is really, really it's good, but it's really, really, really solid. Myself today, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. And it's flown off the shelf already. And we are so confident that we let our colleagues to have one month free of the sleep of God challenge. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, our our colleagues are staying there. Yeah. They, they, they really, I mean, we will show you good results soon. Yeah. But you see, what we can do is for you to put the wooden box, and then uh, you know, uh, you can put you want to put vegetables, you want to put uh, dry food. Yeah. This is the best Christmas. It's not that expensive. We we'll just charge you the, the packaging cost, which yeah. is fifteen. It's very simple. Yeah. So yeah. we're keeping it simple. Yeah, and then I think a 
lot of times you buy the gift is, I mean, you buy the gift is a lot of things that you need.